Hey guys, how's it going? Miss PC Tricks back with you again. Today I'm going to show you how to put a wallpaper on the background of your app pages on your iPod Touch. Now most people with an iPod Touch already know you can put a background on the lock screen. Well, with the iPod Touch iOS 4 update for like the iPod 2 and 3 and with the new iPods, the iPod, 4, uh, the iPod Touch 4th generation, you can put an image on the home screen which previously you were only able to do if you jailbroke your iPhone or your iPod. Please understand, I've been getting a lot of questions about this. Do not jailbreak your iPod to get this function. You do not need to do that. It comes with it now. Um, all you have to do is plug your iPod Touch into iTunes and get the update if you don't already have the iOS 4 update. Um, or if you have the iPod 4G, it will automatically come with it. So, we can see I have, I'll pick a short screen here, I have like this cheetah background right now. This is a home screen uh, image. So any apps as they slide by have this background on it. So what you're going to do is you're going to go into your, uh, your photo album, and that's the little icon down here, just the photos. You're going to pick a photo that you want to apply as your home screen background. And it can be any photo, any of these that are on here. And I'll just pick one out right quick here. Say I want this photo to be my background. All you have to do is click the little up arrow button at the bottom left of the screen. Say use as wallpaper. Then you move it if you want to or scale it down, scale it bigger. And then click set. And then it'll give you the option of setting as the lock screen or setting as the home screen or setting for both. So for the purpose of the video, I'm just going to do set home screen. And it says setting wallpaper. So we'll close out of it. And bada bing bada boom. This is our new wallpaper. Nifty, huh? And all of that without having to jailbreak your iPod. Don't ask me why Apple didn't do that years ago, back when they came out with the iPod Touch the first time. It's like if you have wallpaper for your lock screen, why wouldn't you want it for your home screen? Black is boring. So now you know how to do it for your home screen. If you don't know how to do it for the lock screen, it's the same exact process. You just click the photo and then use the wallpaper and click set lock screen instead of saving as the home screen. All there is to it. So easy peasy. Um, I'll say it again. Don't jailbreak your iPod for this. You can do it yourself. Um, if you have any questions about how to do it, feel free to drop me a note on my Facebook page or on YouTube. I'm happy to help with it. Um, if you want to know where I get these wallpapers, you can either go to the, like, the Google image search on the iPod Touch if you're on Wi-Fi, and then you can just save the picture there. Or I have this Wallpapers HD app and there's tons of wallpapers there. You'd be all day trying to look through all of them. But there's some really cool ones. You just pick it. Say I want it. Ooh, it's kind of girly flowery. No. Okay, so if you find one that you like, here's one, and then you just save it using this little download button. And it's saved. And then you find it in your photos again. So if you don't have any photos that you want to use as your wallpaper already on your iPod, then either download like the free wallpapers app or go to Google Image Search and find a photo that you like there. Pretty easy. It's all free and um, makes your iPod background a little more interesting too. So that's all for today. Thanks for watching.